Hi guys, let's look at subtotals in Microsoft Excel. Uh, when you talk about subtotals, these are totals of groups. Like for instance, I have a database on my workbook where I have sales people, I have amount sold or sales, I have data uh, that, is, that is date of sales and commission. So I need to know uh, how much in various dates, in various sales, in various circumstances, did each salesperson uh, uh, sell. So the first step is to highlight your data. Then you go to data menu, then sort. Remember the first step when doing subtotals is to sort. So I need to sort my guys in ascending order, uh, that is. So you realize that um, each person has been uh, consolidated. Uh, despite the uh, different dates, these guys have been consolidated. So what I need to do is now to uh, find uh, how much sales each did. So I just go back to data menu, then I go to subtotals. In subtotals dialog box, I have at each change in. Here is where I choose the field that I have sorted. Then next, use function. Remember these are subtotals. You are talking about summation. So you choose sum. Then I need to know how much uh, in accumulation did each salesperson uh, sell in different dates. So I click on amount sold. Then the others you don't um, uh, read a touch. Then from there, you click on OK. So once I do that, you realize that um, this uh, guy here, Enkoho, uh, sold uh, a cumulative total of 3.5 uh, million. Then if you go to James King, James King, this is his various sales in various dates. You can see these are uh, various dates. He sold uh, this amount here. So I can be in a position to see uh, how much uh, this guy sold. Then when you go to Majimatamu up, uh, down here, you can be in a position to see in various dates, this guy uh, sold an accumulative of this. When you go to Matundra here, you can also see that this guy uh, sold this amount of uh, cash. Then Otieno here also uh, did a sales of 1.5 uh, million. Then we have the grad total or the cumulative of all. So this is what we call subtotals, guys. Then uh, on your extreme uh, left here, we have number one. When you click number one, it hides the subtotals and the, the stuff and display the grad total. When we click number two, uh, we get the subtotals and the grad total displayed. When we click on uh, number three, everything else is uh, displayed. You can also uh, do the same by clicking on these minus symbols uh, here, these ones, but uh, that one is a bit uh, uh, wanting. So just use this small number one, small number two, small number three here. Then somebody else might ask, what if now I want to remove the subtotals? So what you do, you just again uh, highlight your stuff, go to data, go to subtotals, then remove all. So once you click on remove all, uh, you get your, your data back. So basically, uh, that's how you can perform subtotals uh, in uh, Microsoft Excel so that you can be in a position to uh, get various uh, totals of groups, that is group totals, and you will be in a position to uh, be in a position to uh, uh, see uh, something that is vivid, that is something that is really uh, understandable. So guys, remember to subscribe if you haven't done so for me. Also comment, like the videos, and also share them with your friends. Thank you very much.